My life has constantly shifted from the snowy caps of Mauna Kea to the imposing stature of Diamond Head, from conversing with Pigeon to presentations in proper English. I had lived a life spreading aloha, now I was mocked for that aloha. Following into high school, hey how's it echoed through the halls, a common phrase that I had almost forgotten, a phrase said by my future friend Ando. Over the next four years of what felt like constant summer heat, I had questioned Ando on speaking Pigeon. He explained, you know what, the kind, it's in me. Pidgin is the language that unifies the many people of Hawaii. It is you and it is me. So you know, it's the kind. My family sat around for dinner, eating dumplings and fried rice. My younger brother explained how his date went. Puzzled, my parents requested he rephrase it in Chinese. Teenage frustration grew before he snapped, Why don't you understand what I say in English? Tempers running short, my parents replied, English is difficult for us. You don't spend much effort learning Chinese anyway. Tension grew around the table, and also in my stomach. Determined to defuse the situation, I patiently explained my brother's words in Chinese to them. Then they asked me how my day went. Normal conversation resumed, emotions dissipated from the table, I breathed a sigh of relief.